Hey everybody, what's up? In today's video, we're going to be reviewing an application for the iPhone that turns your iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch into a personal little portable scanner or portable photocopier for absolutely free. The application is called Scan Pages. You can download it for free from the App Store and also by the link that I will provide in the video's description. So this application does what we all wish that we had on our phones for a long, long time. So if you've ever had something that you've needed to make a copy of, but you don't have access to a photocopier or a scanner, what we've done is probably what I like to call the ghetto version of scanning basically where you have your paper and you take a picture of it and then boom you use that as your copy but we don't want to use a picture that we took as a photocopy we want an actual legitimate photocopy and so this application essentially does that it scans your picture of your college textbook your drawing or your important business papers or something that you need a copy of and it can actually scan them on your phone and allow you to share them with whatever you need to share so as again the application is scan pages you can download it for free and let's go ahead and take a look at the application so right now I'm going to apologize if you guys see me looking down at my phone that is because I am referencing the application right now to tell you all about it so the first thing that you'll notice when you open up the application is you have an option to take a new picture or open an existing picture so if you have done that before take a picture of whatever thing that you want to you can actually take that existing picture and scan it through with this but for the sake of this video we are going to use a brand new picture so I went and I drew a nice little picture for you guys of something of like a little I like trains kind of poster my battery on my camera is dying so let's get this done really quick but it is a little simple I like trains thing right here. And we're going to use the camera right here to take a picture of it. And then what we're going to do is it'll bring up these little yellow uh, rec rectangle areas. And then you can crop the rectangle areas to select only the area that you want to scan. Then you click the clean up button and it will clean it up and essentially work its magic and turn it into a little scanner. And it actually looks like we went through a photocopier and that's actually pretty neat. You can do this with more than just your pictures that you've drawn. As you can see here, I have my trigonometry book, and I can copy this random page that I've turned to out of the trigonometry book. And let's show you some examples. Here's the picture I took of my trig book without any of the editing. And as you can see, it looks like a boring picture of my trig book. And then right here, is the finished product, the scan version of the trig book. And I actually printed this out to use with my class so I didn't have to lug the book with me. And so once you're done, it'll bring you up to a page that looks like this, where you can choose to be done with it, to add yourself like a little description of the photo. You can even choose to see the original and see the scan version. And then you can choose export, where you can export it to everything that you want to. You, you can export it to your camera gallery. You can export it to Evernote, Dropbox, Google Docs, and a couple more that are on there. I don't really have in front of me right now and if you want to print it directly from the phone if you have air print enabled on your phone you can export it to the gallery and then click print right here to print it directly from your phone and so that is basically how it works and that's basically the only thing that this application does and I think it does it pretty well as you can see here example other example I don't know why I just did that but now looking at the application I really like some of the things that they did with it such as this little button up here at the top gives you like a little diagram showing you everything to do and how to export if you click the I button and click on settings it, you can choose the settings for everything to export to such as Evernote Dropbox or Google Docs and I really like the way that they organize everything right here you can click the arrow and it'll bring you back to that little menu and I really like the way that it organizes it via date and so pretty much that's it for the application very simple but it does something that we've always wanted to do with our phones so that's it that's scan pages you can download it for free from the app store or the link down below hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you for watching if you have any more applications that you would like me to review let me know by commenting and I'll try to get around to it I haven't been posting too many videos lately because I've been having too many things going on in my personal life I'm talking really fast right now and I think I'm going to end the video here so thank you a lot for watching and I will see you guys in the next video later and again I pointed the camera really awkward see you later and yes my battery didn't die woohoo